Yo, what's good with y'all, man? You know we back outside with it, bro. So real quick, I'm gonna get straight into the video, man. Yo, if you happen to be going through something, bro, do not let the situation get the best of you. All right? If you happen to be coming from, like, let's say a family that doesn't really believe in what you believe in or whatnot, or, like, your family thinks they mean well for you when really, like, they're just, they're really kind of hindering you, bro, hang in there. First of all, they're there for a reason. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes, bro, like when you related to certain people, uh, there's there's levels of love, I should say. Um, and then there, there, I would say this, there's the matrix love, and this is just my perspective on it. And then you got that like real love, that unconditional, like, let's say I was a basketball player and my son, he grew up and I, want, I wanted him to be a basketball player, but he didn't want to be in a basketball. He wanted to be the world's top uh playing ch uh, ch chess player in the world you know what i'm saying i have to accept that as a parent whether whether it's whether i like it or not you feel me that's that type of love what we call that the unconditional love right so i ain't gonna lie bro unconditional love is kind of hard to find man i mean you ain't gonna probably the only person you really probably gonna find it from for real for real is your mama <laughs> okay your mom and your daddy but really really your moms you know what i'm saying and even then sometimes we have people you know i knew a friend who had a tough like upbringing and it's crazy bro this is why i say it is so everything comes full circle bro it is so important to take care of yourself take care of your mental take care of whatever the traumas you had in the past like you have to take care of that bro because you don't want to get into a relationship with a female and then boom, 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 you knock her up or you, or even if you plan to have a kid with this girl and you do, guess what? Any of the trauma that you had, if it's not solved within you, unfortunately, it might, it might play out through the child. This is why I say we have to be, we have to protect our energy. You see what I'm saying? I know people right now who go through the same thing every single day, bro. You know what I'm saying? And it's and it's sometimes the people who are going through so much that never did nothing, didn't ask to be into didn't ask to come here at this point in time, gotta deal with BS every two seconds, arguing with the moms, arguing with the dads, arguing with such and such, whoever, right? That kind of puts you out of a good type of vibration. Now, like when you return to the world, it's like you at home arguments arguments this that, and third combobulation you know whatever i gotta go out and get this money so now your new addiction becomes getting money because you don't want to go home or you don't want to be with your girl you know what i'm saying like how, how you how you got a baby with this girl and now you know what i'm saying you have to raise a family and now y'all don't get along at all because there's unsolved trauma man that has happened in her life in your life i guarantee it so whatever you're going through, let's say it's not even your fault because sometimes it's not your fault. I, I know kids who have parents that, that don't even deserve to be parents. I'm going to keep it 1,000. And the reason why I say that is because you got some parents that are still acting like the kids. 1,000%. I'm going to keep it 100, man. You still got grown people not caring what their age is and like you know what oh i got kids and whatnot but i still want to live my life why are you being so selfish bro you know what i'm saying there's a lot of people out here like yo man like you know what i'm saying when you have a kid that's a huge responsibility i know your whole life is going to change you know I, now i'm kind of waiting on it man i i just seen one of my boys shout out to uh my boy dennis he just had a son this is crazy and what I told y'all about leveling up, man, and being yourself, because my boy Dennis, oh, he was probably one of the most lamest people, dog. I ain't gonna lie. I love him to death, and he knows this. You know what I'm saying? We used to crack jokes on him all the fucking time. But you know what? The thing, the one thing about Dennis is that he didn't give a, he didn't care. He was gonna be himself regardless. And I like that about him. He never changed. People used to say, oh, Dennis, you should tone it down. Oh, Dennis, you should do this. Oh, Dennis this, Dennis that. Dennis didn't care. And what Dennis actually ended up doing was finding a wife. People didn't think he could do that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because back then, he, the, the, the female attraction, I guarantee you, this dude had to work on himself. I promise you. He had to put himself 
in a situation because again, everybody's coming from t some type of back background. The foundation may not be as solid as others, but that doesn't mean that you're 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 uh you're trapped or you have no hope. You actually you actually have an advantage. You have more of a more of a motivation to do better. So whenever your situation may be crazy, you know you y'all know what time it is. The matrix and even sometimes people will repeat their actions. They will say something to you that they forgot they said to you already. So if you know that everybody's still going to be operating in the same kind of predictive, you know what I'm saying, way, why put all of your emotion into it, man? This is just a moment in time. Don't let the situation that you're in now get the best of you. You see what I'm saying? Never change for nobody. Uniquely be you. Even if there's something about you that maybe is just not of the matrix or whatnot, learn how to utilize it still, man. Because again, like, I'm telling you, bro, like this shit is it's powerful, bro. Like when you can sit here and don't let the negative uh, energy affect you, you become that positive sponge. So any type of negati negativity that does come towards you, you'll know how to handle it. You see what I'm saying? Keep a even, calm, cool, collect. I know it's hard. I know it's crazy out here in the matrix. People is, will, there's women, men, there's people who will always be stuck in their ways. And you may have to deal with them from time to time still, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I'm in a part, I'm in a full-time job right now. Probably the best full-time job of my life, but I, you know me, I'm not a work, I'm not, I'm not that. You know? I wish I could take two, three, four days off in a row just to do it. But of course, when you're working at a new place or whatnot, you gotta earn them days. You know what I'm saying? You gotta work a whole year, nigga, not miss a day. You know what I'm saying? I want to. I want to be free, free. You know what I'm saying? Right now, again, I, I'm not. I'm not mad at anybody that I met at that job or anything like that. Cause I met some dope people. But this time, in this situation, with and with my whole entire situation right now, just yesterday, I had to like kind of reanalyze. I'm like, I'm not in a bad like spot, but I feel myself expanding. And when I feel my, like, bro, when, when when you feel like you're bigger than your setting and, and I don't know cocky shit, it's just your spirit letting you know, like, yo, you have to clamp down a little bit more harder, man. You got to like, it's game time. You have to be prepared for what is about to come for you, bro. Because you've been taking care of yourself. You have the access to the infinite intelligence by going with them, by holding on to your sexual energy, your natural sexual en energy. Your mind is becoming better every single time, every single day. The longer you you go another day holding on to your seed, and it, and you could be and it could be a stressful fucking day. And you still you still go through the day, you know, da 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 XYZ. Cause at the end of the day, I'm not gonna lie, the one of the best feelings for me is going through a hard ass day, not depending on weed, not depending on busting a nut, not depending on texting a female. When it's just me, bro, and I get through the night. I feel so much more powerful in the morning, man. I feel like I like okay, I like I did it. I like I really did this shit. It's Friday, Saturday, people out here getting drunk, getting high, getting fucked, getting fucked, getting drunk, getting high. All that shit, goddamn, who cares? You know what I'm saying? The shit gonna happen everywhere. And I wasn't trying to rap, but like that's how that shit be coming out sometimes. You feel me? I be in mid conversation, nigga be like, nigga, you trying to spit a bar, nigga? Like what the fuck? Nah, but uh, MGT, what to it do? It's your boy Moody Star, and I'm back again with another video. If you're new, you already know what to do. Maybe become a subscriber, like the video, and join MGT. This is a channel where I like to highlight current events and talk about my spiritual walk here in this beautiful matrix. Now, first of all, I got to say a special shout out to anybody that's holding on to your energy, going within and being high vibrational. Here at MGT, this is what we do. We work on ourselves every single day. So, yeah, bro, don't let your situation get the best of you, bro. This is just a moment in time, bro. You about to level up. I feel it, nigga. I ain't gonna lie. If we are, if we're operating on the same type of frequency, bro, I can, I can feel the level up happen. Funny story, bro. And I'm not even gonna say no names real, real quick, but I'm not, I'm not, it's not gonna be too long because I actually did my intro to the outro. This is how you know, this is how you know, like, you just, it's like the, the matrix wasn't built for certain people, right? It wasn't, it wasn't made for certain kinds of people, certain kinds of entities if you get what i'm saying um at one point in time they didn't even consider us to be a human 
you know what i'm saying two fifths anywho we it's all obvious you know what i'm saying if you're if you uh if you are of the darker tone the matrix is not out it's like the matrix could care less actually no i take that back the matrix does not want certain people to elevate in consciousness Oh, they want the muscles and the, they want you to jump and dribble a basketball and shit like that. They want you to do that. They want you to like talk really fast and rap about bullshit. You feel me? That's what they want you to do. But what they don't want you to do as a darker tone being is elevating consciousness. Bro, the moment you realize that and you start elevating yourself in consciousness, even when you are qualified for some shit, bro, they still going, they still not going to give you a chance, bro. This is why, if y'all ever heard the saying years ago, man, like if your mom ever told you, like, yo, if you a little bit darker, bro, you know you gotta work 30 times harder. I don't know why, I don't know why it's set up, color is, I don't know, you know what I'm saying? But it is what it is, man. With that being said, if a motherfucker keep denying you, that means you're doing something right. And when I say denying you, like if you're trying to like get a house or some shit and get approved and they keep denying you, it's, it's for a reason though, it's to build your character. You know when you get that kingdom, bro, Zero, zero BS tolerated, bro. When your kingdom comes, it's coming. That actually happened to my homeboy. They got, they had him approved for a spot, and then called back and within the same day. Oh, sorry, we made a mistake. It was somebody else that got approved, and it, of course, it was a different type of person, to say the least. No pun intended. But with that being said, I'm not even tripping on that. That's just small third dimensional shit man what are we doing spiritually every single day to cultivate ourselves are you making your spirit happy are you talking to your soul are you actually talking to your soul are you can you actually talk to yourself comfort comfortably you know what i'm saying not on no crazy shit but like do you have a real relationship with yourself i remember there's a saying right or there's this theory it's not a saying it's a theory that the human body is a vessel and within this vessel are two beings. It's probably multiple beings, but let's just say two beings. You know what I'm saying? Think about it. Mommy, daddy. Mommy energy, daddy energy. When you look at our brain and the spine, if you take everything else away from us, take, take, take them arms, legs, and everything, what does that look like? What does the brain and your spinal cord look like? A sperm cell, right? You keep them 1,000. So it's like, I'm, I'm just trying to tell you, dog, like, you are... And I'm not to mention even the, 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 bro, I haven't talked about my dreams, bro, but you are a multidimensional being. And I, now I got to make a separate video for my video. I mean, for my, uh, for my dreams, dog. Cause I'm having like mad flashbacks right now. Like just doing so much shit, dog, within a little bit of time. <laughs> but without saying too much, I'm going to end the video for today. Make sure you like, share, comment down below, drop a bag on the cash up to support the team. It's for your boy, Movie Star. I'm gonna definitely see you guys on the next video. It's a little, it's a little rainy and wet today, man. I ain't gonna lie. OJ, next time I see OJ, it's on site. Not just playing. I actually seen her last night, but um, yeah, she be doing her thing, man. She, you know, what I'm telling you, something about cats, dog. Like they don't need your ass. <laughs> you feel me? But they gonna pop up when they pop up. But yeah, man. Shout out to NGT Moody Gang Team. The day ones are Moody Gang team. And then you feel me? Just like in general, making great talent. That's what we do. But shout out to the day ones. MGT OGs. Uh, drop a 100 emoji. If you're still around since before a thousand subscribers. <laughs> you feel me? Before this channel got monetized. Shout out to you. I feel like out of all 10,000 subs, it's probably like 300 people who actually fuck me. And I appreciate y'all. So much love on this side. I'm going to see you guys on the next video, man. Peace.